pretty big game, James. How's that for a sell? I'm just thinking when you play with your country's flag on your chest, everything is a little different. It means a little more. Opening face-off is set to go. Referee Gilles is ready to drop the puck. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. Finland's gained possession along the boards. Referee signals penalty coming up here with a delayed call. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see what the officials are calling. It's an abrupt end for his night. He's just been handed a game misconduct on the play. Yeah, and some of the old ranks, this was a good play because you could get to the hot water first. <laughs> Ajo's got the puck along the wing. That's a solid hit. Puts it to the front of the net, and he scores! What a shot! Really good work in the offensive zone here, as the shooter keeps moving around till he finds the open spot. In this case, it's gold. He's in the high slot and he hammers it home. Team Finland's on the board here. They've got the opening goal of the game here late in the opening frame. All you want after the first is to be even or ahead. They've done most of it. Now you have to finish the job. Let's it go! Big time save with the blocker! And there she blows. The horn sounds. That'll do it for this period number one. We've got a one nothing game here after the first 20 minutes of play. Hey, fans, we'd like to draw your attention to the far part of the arena where we're welcoming all of our... 40 minutes of regulation still to play. We're looking forward to it. Hopefully you are too. Second period set to get underway. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ray, we've already got 20 minutes under our belt here. What are your thoughts of this one so far? Scores! That's back to back, Ray. Well, the, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outcome. He didn't waste any time. If he would have stopped that puck, the goalie would have had time to readjust. As it is, it's in the net. Finland's got a two-goal lead now. Do you subscribe to the theory a good defense is a good offense? 100% in particular the way that the game is played these days. Too easy to call penalties against you if you sit back. I say play in the other end. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Spees has been brought down and we're going to get a penalty here. Shot denied by the goaltender. Let's see the call here. Just an old school tripping call here on this yeah, one, right? Sometimes I think you just get burned here. A little bit of a bad break. You're fishing around for the puck and you're stick gets into the other guy's feet. Key for any team on the power play is to get control of the puck first. So we'll look at the face-off and this power play at the... Scores! Power play goal! Uh, critical for them to get on the board with the extra man. They move the puck well and they're able to capitalize. The power play was patient. They worked around until they found the best shot. But if they don't have that traffic in front of the net, it's not going to matter. The puck goes through the traffic, past the goalie, and they've got a power play goal. Switzerland's got new life here in this second period, Ray. It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shift. Puck scooped up by Ristolainen. Pushes it across to Ajo. Finland's message going into this one when we talked to them at the morning skate was to get a lot of pucks on net. They've done just that, and they lead as a result. Heischer's won the draw. Taken by Yossi. Scores! We're all tied up! And now they're 
bench has a little more belief as they've evened up the score. While off the faceoff, that snaps back cleanly. The one-timer is pounded into the net. If you've got a couple of centers that can win faceoffs, this gives you some options on the draw. This time, it's one quick win, and it's in the net. More than half the period has expired. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Haas wins possession in the defensive zone. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. There's the whistle. Let's get the official decision. Tripped him up, and he's off to the box for it, Ray. Reaching out for the puck, you get your stick into his feet. This is the consequence. And the goalie leaves his crease to play the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Mata. Back at the point, they set it up. He scores! They take the lead! Well, it looked like this game was going to be even for the longest time because nobody seemed to have the upper hand. They're just trying to get out of this alive to keep the game tied. What a gift, a shorthanded goal, an outstanding effort. And now they've got the lead. Team Switzerland's got some breathing room here late in the second as they take a one-goal lead. I'd get my best players back on the ice, and while you've got your opponent backed up a little bit, try and get another one. Takes it across the blue line. Solid hit on that play. He scores! How's that to close things out? Wow, what a great time for a goal. I mean, you're happy when you score any time, but so late in the period, now you can carry momentum over the intermission. Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area, and the rebound is put away. Finland's equalizer comes at a critical time of the game, late in the period, isn't it, Ray? Anytime you give up a goal late in the period, you feel like you've given up more than that. So this is a critical goal. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. There's the horn to end the period. 3-3. All tied up. Should be a fun third period. Willemans Recycling is a proud sponsor of tonight's game. Willamette's Recycling recycles enough paper to save more than 41 million trees. Big third period still to come. Services, we'll get ready for it. Website. Hope you'll join us. They've got numbers. Heiskanen's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. And let's see what the definitive call is on the ice. Looks like tripping the call. Sometimes they're lazy, sometimes they're just bad luck. Here's a short pass to Kapanen. Rocked him in the open ice. Quick snap! Oh, he's gonna be shaking his head after that one. Yeah, you go back to the bench. There's the goal ahead goal, and we have a new game! Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace, you push the other guys back on their heels. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Finland's been pushing all night long offensively. They finally get the big goal to put them up here in the third. They've had the puck the whole time, it seems like. Chance after chance, there was a danger here. They were going to get frustrated, but now they have the lead. Team Finland's got the edge in the shot department, a big reason why they lead here in this third period. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Niederreiter swooping in on the attack. Centering pass. Scores! Well, the game back to level now. Anybody that's had a lead, the lead is gone, and now we're evened up again. 
A quick flick of the wrist, and that snapshot beats the goaltender. He's in the low slot. He doesn't have much time to think about it. Switzerland's heart on full display here in the later stages of this third period with that big goal. Never back down, kept pushing, finally even this game up. Now hopefully can find the winner. Slides the puck over. Koibu's got it into offensive territory. Makes his press, scores! And he puts his team in front! James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. Well, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. Finland's found themselves a critical goal here late in the third period. Now a question is, hanging on, can they do it? Trailing in this one, they have pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. Moves it quickly over to Pugliarvi. Gets it over to Aho. Wide open net. Oh, off the crossbar. Oh, you're going to make your mama cry. Shoot it in the middle of the net. Faceoff becomes one that is a must win. Extra attacker at one end, but an empty net at the other as this faceoff looms. Yeah, you draw the play up. You look for the faceoff win for a quick shot. It is all over. Puck possession, the name of the game in this one tonight, Ray. Really good job. They had the puck, they kept the puck, and when they didn't have a play, they seemed to put it into a place where they were going to get it next. They controlled the play and therefore controlled the game. And that'll do it for Ray Perl. I'm James Sabalski. Thank you.